Who's going to start it off? It's a great <laughs> pumpkin, Charlie Brown. Sorry, our timing is off today. <laughs> We're going to go with it. We're going to go with yeah, it. Yeah, let's do it. It's a great pumpkin, Charlie Brown, Trista Milliman. And uh, I think that's going to be the topic of our yeah. uh, discussion today. Yep. Do you got anything you want to tease before we get uh, into it? I got nothing. Got nothing? Uh, no. This is awkward. Let's just <laughs> let's just go just go to the intro. Our mission is to promote strategies and policies which ensure improved health for all citizens of Noata County. We're back. We're back. Yay. Man. I hope that's as funny as it sounded when we were planning it. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> it is not, but no, it's fine. No, it's it's like for real podcast Friday. Yeah. Because it is yeah. Friday. It's the first the time we've been back on track for a while. We've been yeah. kind of miscellaneous cool. trying to get them in when we could. But yep. uh, do you know the date? God, Trista, like, man, okay, we are so check. unprepared. It's October 22nd. October 22nd. Yeah. yeah. 2021. And um, we've kind of had, we've been doing a lot of, uh, here at Noah Can, we've been doing a lot of processing, thinking about what we're going to be doing for uh, 2022, basically. Mm -hmm. And uh, it, on the T-Set side of things, we're getting our action plan put together. We're really getting ready to get back full into the community. And one of the things that Trista came up with is uh, this, it's a great pumpkin, Charlie Brown. So tell us a little bit about that, and we'll talk more about our long-term plans. Well, I think, like, we've been kind of brainstorming for a while about how to bring the community together more, um, have more of those community events. And so I just thought, hey, let's get a big outdoor screen and watch the great pumpkin during Halloween. And I think that's a good way to kick off Easy our peasy. whole thing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, so... It's a free family event. I think we want to emphasize the word free. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and we're actually partnering with um, a few downtown businesses to kind of help us out with snacks that night. And um, so we are going to set up in the parking lot across from City Hall. So that's like that parking lot there right behind uh, Wise Beans, right behind the coffee shop. And um, we're going to start at 7 o'clock. And we're going to have popcorn, ice cream, Hot drinks, like probably cider, hot chocolate, maybe cookies. I don't know. I don't want to promise all of that. But, um, <laughs> but everything it, changes. It, it, yeah. Logistics. Yeah. Um, but there will be free goodies there. And um, we encourage everybody to bring their own lawn chairs, blankets if it's a little chilly outside. Um, and then we'll also have some straw bales. If you don't have a lawn chair, you can come cozy up on some straw bales. Um, we'll have those out there for our. If you follow our Facebook page, you can't really yeah. see this real close, but the date is the 29th, mm -hmm. and did we say 7 o'clock? 7 o'clock, yep. 7 o'clock, 29th, uh, in the City Hall parking lot, there's at least three murals yeah. right in there. Yep. And if you follow our Facebook page, No One Can Facebook page, I mean, it's it's that simple, just mm -hmm. search it if you're not already following us and everything. Um, but about two weeks ago, we purchased a uh, red carpet and yeah. the stanchion stanchion's a new word for me. Those are, those are stanchion. like the gold or shiny posts that you hang yeah. the red ropes from. And, uh, if, again, if you've been following us or whatever, you've probably seen mm -hmm. us up at wise beans. We, we officed out of wise beans for a couple of days and we had some VIP seating <laughs> with our, our, our red velvet <laughs> ropes. It's really fancy for no one. I'm really excited yeah. about it. Yep. Um, but it's just a fun thing. It's kind of whimsical. Mm -hmm. Uh, it's hopefully we have good weather, yeah. but it's really just to have, be in community and the whole concept of community, we can use community in a lot of different ways, but community is being able to just be a part of, of what's going on in town mm -hmm. and feel welcome and be in a healthy yeah. environment, a uh, safe place, um, being downtown just around people and using the resources and supporting your local businesses and uh basically that's the end goal right right if if you want to live in in a certain town you want to be a place that you feel accepted you want to be a place that you feel safe you want to be in a place that uh people are happy and nice mm -hmm. and and uh, just be in community i think yeah. that's my definition of community there's probably a webster's dictionary I'm version sure. of it but i'm sure um, but how does that play into well, to your grant and our grant? Well, so 
I think that when we bring more people together all the time, we've talked about this like before, mm-hmm. where we bring everybody together. We make like this positive family environment. Um, families can come and, and feel like they can, you know, um, interact in a safe way. Um, it, it just improves the environment around us and not like i'm not like talking climate change environment i'm talking like social, <laughs> social environment i said it, i said um, this this event is going to keep the ice yeah. caps from melting i did <laughs> i said environmental change the other day and i was like wow that sounds like i'm talking about climate change i'm not talking about that kind of environmental right. change but um just the social um like just social change like you know different expectations about how or or what is it? Raising the expectations of how um, a family functions and and that kind of thing in our community. So, anyway, um, and you don't. I I do want to emphasize this. You don't have to have kids to come watch. It's right. a great pumpkin, Charlie Brown. Yeah. Because we're bring your inner child. Yes, and that will yes. be good enough. <laughs> all children, all ages, from you know zero to hundred. <laughs> I, uh, planning something like this that's just. We're trying to keep it as simple as mm-hmm. possible. Anybody that's involved, uh, we want them to just be focused on their thing and not have to worry about anything else. Just do your part and do yep. it really well. Yep. You know, if uh, if you know, I think what I'm going to do is set up the projector and a projector screen, mm-hmm. and if I can be helpful in other things, but I'll make darn sure that I have all everything I need. Yep. Anybody, uh, I think we've invited Grand Lake to yep. come up, and they've already, I think they've committed some people yes. to come up and have a yes. tent. Um, if, but the the idea is. It's not on any one person mm-hmm. to make sure that this all goes exactly no. as planned. The Great Pumpkin, do you know what the runtime is on that? Oh, it's like, it's, golly, it's around a half hour, 45 minutes. I mean, it's not for so very long. So it's not long. a huge deal. No, no, it's not a we don't huge want time commitment. everybody just... to have to drag out a million chairs yeah. and everybody, you know, it's, that's where we see a, a lot of things not happen. Um, mm-hmm. uh, because it's like, man, that's just way too much work. And sometimes yeah. we don't know what the turnout's going to be. So if we have 10 people, we're going to be happy. If we have 100 people, we're yeah. hoping to to meet that need. <laughs> yeah. And uh, we just don't know. Uh, but this is a, a thing that we want to just keep learning about. You know, when we do this, we have a good turnout. When we do, we do this, we don't. Why did we mm-hmm. not? I think with anybody that's on any board or any community uh, uh, organization, the fear is always, Oh crap, we have to have this kind of turnout. This is everything is done and paid for. Mm-hmm. We're not super stressing it. And so just be patient. If we do have 300 people show up, we may not have everything. If we have five people show up, <laughs> then we're going to count as a success. It's hard to see the screen with that many yeah, people. Yeah. <laughs> we did get a big screen, a big outdoor screen. But, 120 um, inches. Yeah. Pretty awesome. Yeah. So, um, but it's supposed to, I've been watching the weather. Like crazy, I just um, you know hoping for no rain. I know it's supposed to be dry, but it's probably supposed to be a little cool too. So that's why I encourage people to perfect bring blankets, harvest up. weather, and and so you might be thinking Friday, October 29th, That's downtown trick or treat. We did that on purpose because so downtown trick or treat will be going on from three to five that night on October 29th. Mm-hmm. And then that way we've given people enough time to kind of get home, get their stuff put away, um, and come back at 7 o'clock and join us for that movie. So um, I think we wanted, we wanted to encourage kiddos' costumes if they for still sure. want to wear their costumes oh, yeah. um, there that night. But um, it's, just, it's just come and go, mm-hmm. you know, pretty casual. The, the, the overall concept is just let's make it simple. Let's not overstress it. If, if we don't have a great turnout, we'll learn something. Mm-hmm. Like, and do we need to make it earlier? Do we make it later? Blah, blah, blah. Do we need to do something yeah. different? We definitely want people's suggestions, too, on ideas for right. other, for other um, you know, future mm. get-togethers That's a good segue. that we put together. Um, we were talk, we were kind of hinting at earlier, okay. like, our overall plan going forward of, uh, you know, being involved in the community again. You know, tri- or, uh, Misty and I's grant, the TSET grant, We've been very paperwork heavy for like the last year and a half, and it's about time that we get to get back mm-hmm. out in the community. And this is an opportunity for us to be a part of the community, give back to the community, and uh, we're going to have information on TSET mm-hmm. stuff. We're going to have information on PFS and DFC, which are our other two grants that Crystal and Trista do. And so it's a win-win for us. We get to put on an event. We get to offer 
uh, educational mm -hmm. materials about all the things that we do. And um, we're hoping to continue, to, isn't that kind of the plan, yeah. is to continue to do an, an event. And I will throw this in here. Um, I think like every other month is what we talked about. Okay, that sounds yeah. like a good pace. So, now, and if, yeah. if, if there's an overwhelming desire to, mm -hmm. to do it more often and the payout is totally worth it, then sure, we might be able to do it more. Um, we're, it's all, it's all going to be a learning experience. Um, but through the beautification committee, there is a subcommittee, I guess you mm -hmm. would call it, called ACTION, and it's an acronym for Arts, Culture, Humanities of No Water, something like that. Uh, culture. Coalition. Coalition, yeah, in No Water. Yeah. And so... Um, Myself, Paul Hughes, and uh, David Sutton, Bragg, Sutton Bragg, uh, also known as Arrow, uh, part of the beautification is to do host mm -hmm. community events. And so we're wanting to team up as action with No One Can or partnership. And I just, you know, it's a little fuzzy because I'm part of both of them. But there's mutual benefits mm -hmm. uh, to, to this organization and that organization. And we would like to continue, you know, as far as action goes, I have a lot of sound equipment, video equipment and stuff like that. That might be a contribution that, you know, going forward, uh, that if it's a community, a healthy community event and your organization is doing something along those lines to promote uh, uh, nutrition, physical activity, tobacco cessation, uh, alcohol awareness, any of that kind of stuff, those are things that we can help partner with. And we welcome that because it's not up to know what it can to always create things in the mm -hmm. community. We want to partner with people that are already doing things. We don't have to reinvent the wheel all the time, but, uh, we have this opportunity and we'd like to take it. And, uh, we want you guys to come and participate and kind of experience some community and build some stronger bonds and get some really good ideas of, we can sit here all day and have these great ideas that we think are going to work. Mm -hmm. But somebody that is in the school system has kids and they work a day job or two jobs we need that kind of feedback on like what works for you guys. Mm -hmm. uh, how can we be beneficial to you? Um, we spend a lot of time talking about we are not authority figures. We just want to encourage healthier choices. I mean, really, mm -hmm. at the end of the day, yeah. healthier choices lead to healthier lives, to happier lives, um, safer lives. Mm -hmm. I mean, yeah. I mean, you can draw those conclusions. Yep. So um, I think that in a nutshell is us. Misty, can you tell how long we've been talking or how long I've been rambling here? We're at 12 minutes. <laughs> 12 minutes. Okay. Seconds. So well, that's pretty good. I think we've covered yeah, a lot of it. I'm just really excited to get some cool pictures of our no water people on the red carpet. Yeah. Yeah. It's going to be fun. Oh, that's another thing that we didn't necessarily point out. We have a red carpet. We may just roll with the red carpet in every event. Yeah. We may just call it the red yeah. carpet event series or some fun stuff well, like that. Well, we had it on our Facebook <clears throat> page. We took that picture mm -hmm. of the red carpet. So, mm -hmm. um... Yeah, it's going to be a red carpet event. There's uh, going to be some photo ops, mm -hmm. right? Oh, yeah. Opportunities. Yeah. Whatever. We haven't decided exactly what that looks like. Uh, well, I, I can't speak know. towards that. I was going to. Yeah, <laughs> There's no. some things that we, we are planning, and we might as well not put it out there unless we're confident right. in it. Right. But um, at the end of the day, that's what we're trying to accomplish. Uh, if, if you buy into this, you like this kind mm -hmm. of thing, please get on our Facebook page and give us some uh, constructive ideas on how to make it more successful. Mm -hmm. um, this is, you know, planning events isn't our day job, but we, we, we right. have an opportunity to get uh, our message out. Building community is. So right. Um, right. that is right. our day job. And um, things like these, these free family oriented events, um, that's part of what we need to do to, you know, get people involved mm -hmm. and engaged. And so it's going to be a good time. Yeah. Well, and I think we've already done the wrap up because that's, Pretty that's much. ties into, Pretty if much. you got, if you got healthy, fun, safe things to do in the community, then mm -hmm. you, uh, I don't know if I feel, if I feel like I'm being welcomed and I'm going to uh, say, I go over to a person's house that I don't necessarily know real well mm -hmm. and they're inviting and they go, Hey, come in here. Let me, do you want some tea? Have like, some, have some, yeah, there's some hospitality there. So that's, mm -hmm. that's another, you know, way of looking at it, community hospitality of, I want to go and be a part yep. of my community and, and think about other communities that you've seen that do some awesome festivals and stuff like that and go, why mm -hmm. can't no one have that kind of stuff? Well, we do, we do have some, and we uh, hope to add to that. Um, there, I see the tickets there. Is there anything, is um, that just a that's prop just, for? Well, I mean, it is a nice prop. It looks really nice <laughs> on our thing, but, um, 
So for those free goodies that we're going to have that night, when you come up, when you walk up the red carpet, which mm-hmm. is going to be awesome. I've already said that. But it and is, if you want to wear awesome. your ball gown or your, your uh, yeah. red carpet gown. But so, yeah. So when you come up uh, for the event, we will have um, these tickets. Each, each attendee gets one ticket, um, one blue ticket and one red ticket. And those are going to coincide with where you want to get your goodie from so like um slow acres wants to partner with us on this um i i, I asked them to partner with us <laughs> and they they were more than happy to so um you'll be you'll be getting free ice cream from slow acres so you'll just get um a ticket like say the blue tickets are for ice cream so i'll give you a blue ticket and then i'll give you a red ticket for a hot chocolate or whatever and so when you go get your ice cream um during the movie at um slow acres give him the blue ticket and then um sam wisely wisely, um if he's got wise beans yeah wise beans if he's got apple cider and um hot chocolate chocolate. or whatever Mm -hmm. then hand him the red ticket and uh those are your actually this is the way you're paying for your goodies that night um yeah so we're kind of gonna we're gonna see sam can set up back there by the um movie where the movie's at, so you don't have to walk around the front of the building, mm-hmm. um, so you can stay right there with the movie. But um, we'll see how Slow Acres. I'm um, surely they can come behind. You know, yeah, there. may have to go to the alley. We'll have to yeah, figure we, out some we'll logistics. We'll figure something out. But anyway, that's what the tickets are for. That's that's how you're going to pay for your goodies that night. So um, anyway, that's the plan, and uh, we'll execute it as best know. we can. Yeah. And the whole thing is, if it's 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 small enough, it's a small scale that. Mm-hmm. You know, we'll adjust and adapt on the fly. I just want to do something nice for the community, and we hope to continue to do that. You want me to just keep talking? I can talk. Let's just <laughs> just let me just put the camera on me and let me just jabber. I'm just monologue kidding. time. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, yeah. I feel like every time that we go ahead and close this out, I feel like man, if there's one thing that I forgot to say, but I think that covers it in a mm-hmm. nutshell. I would like again. I I will remind people go to our Facebook page and give us some ideas and some suggestions. Not that we can do everything, but uh, we like your feedback. We want to know if there's other more serious suggestions about some of the things that we do on the serious side of stuff, like uh, Trista's grant, Misty's grant, or Misty and I's grant, or Crystal's. Um, by all means, we need community engagement. It's valuable to mm-hmm. us. Uh, your opinion matters. And if we can put it into practice or we can make it uh, something valuable to yep. community, we actually will. We absolutely will. Yep. So. Well, one more time um, before we go. Uh, join us for It's a Great Pumpkin Charlie Brown um, on Friday, October 29th at 7 o'clock in the parking lot across from City Hall. Um, More than welcome to wear a costume. Highly encouraged. Please. <laughs> okay. Fun family atmosphere. Thanks for tuning in. And uh, Misty's going to take us on our outro.